So peripheral arterial disease is lack of blood supply to the peripheries, which includes the limbs. That happens because of blockage in the arteries that supplies the limbs. So the most common symptom is cramping or pain in the legs or hip or buttocks, depending upon the location where you have the blockage. The most common risk factor for peripheral arterial disease is smoking and the other risk factors are diabetes, hypertension, high cholesterol levels, family history, and the downstream effects of having blockages is you'll be having pain initially with walking or any physical activity. Down the road, you might be developing pain even when you're at rest, and you might lose your limb because of the blockage. Generally, I would say like one-fourth of the population has peripheral arterial disease. If they have risk factors, and if they have symptoms, it's better to contact early your nearby cardiologist to get evaluated for peripheral arterial disease.